I'm Nick the History Kid. I'm a young patriot who loves history. Today, I'm in Patterson, New Jersey, commemorating the anniversary of when General George Washington picnic here in 1778. Today, July 10th, 2014, is the 236 year anniversary of this historic picnic. On this day in history, in 1778, George Washington picnic with Marquise de Lafayette and aides Alexander Hamilton and James McHenry, right here at these falls. The Great Falls on New Jersey's Passaic River is the second largest waterfall by volume in the United States east of the Mississippi River. Only Niagara Falls is bigger. Washington and his entourage dined in the shadow of the falls shortly after the Battle of Monmouth on their way to the north of New York City where they intended to monitor the British Army. James McHenry later wrote about the event. After viewing these falls, we seated ourselves under a large spreading oak tree within the spray and in hearing of the noise. They ate cold ham, tongue, and biscuits. I wish I was here 236 years ago to have lunch with Washington. In commemoration of George Washington eating tongue here 236 years ago today, I'm going to have some tongue also. Tastes like ham. It's pretty good. McHenry also said, with the assistance of some spirits, they composed some excellent grog. They chatted away a very cheerful half an hour, and then, as Hamilton wrote, and then we took our leave of the friendly oak. James McHenry was originally a surgeon in the Continental Army, but was asked to join Washington's personal staff at Valley Forge. He later became the third Secretary of War under President Washington. Alexander Hamilton took note of the power of the falls. Years later, as Washington's first Secretary of the Treasury, he developed a plan to harness the falls power to kickstart an industrial revolution in the United States. On this day, 236 years ago, General George Washington took some time to relax 
and enjoy these falls. Today, we can still see what Washington saw and enjoy them as well. The only difference is we don't have the vision and determination to succeed as Washington did. Until next time, I'm Nick the History Kid, and remember my state slogan, New Jersey, from the Revolutionary War to the Jersey Shore, both history and fun awaits you.